The release of chlorofluorocarbons into the atmosphere cause destruction of the ozone and may contribute to global warming. Global warming is caused by long wave radiation from the sun that becomes trapped in the Earth's atmosphere. This trapped radiation slowly heats up the Earth's surface. The ozone layer acts as a filter for the sun's ultraviolet rays. This protects human, plant, and sea life from the damaging effects of the rays. The ozone is destroyed when the ozone molecule comes in contact with a chlorine atom. The chlorine is a component of the chlorofluorocarbon refrigerants. One chlorine atom can destroy up to 100,000 ozone atoms. The depletion of the ozone affects us and our environment around us. This concern was developed into what we refer to as EPA regulations. These regulations identify the types of refrigerants that can be produced and how refrigerants will be used. A pneumatic value has been assigned to each refrigerant and is referred to as ozone depletion potential, ODP. This number expresses the risk to the ozone layer to which of the given refrigerant may cause. Each refrigerant is assigned a number which expresses its global warming potential. GWP. The greater the GWP, the greater risk of the environmental damage. Any refrigerant. <laughs> These are the outtakes. <laughs> Go ahead, you can keep on. It, the, the screen went blank. That's, uh, the, what, that's what uh, happened. Okay. You know what? Let's. What do you mean I can't dip while I do the interview?